based on the now cancelled Fox television series, James Cameron's Dark Angel cast players in the role of the genetically enhanced rogue super soldier named Max. Dark Angel's gameplay revolves around martial arts inspired fighting and stealth maneuvers as Max sets out to uncover the details of her past. And fans of the show will be pleased to note actress Jessica Alba lends her voice talents to her video game counterpart. Oh baby, can we still be friends? Unsure of her past, Max finds herself in a partnership with Logan Kale, a political activist hacker, and together they work to expose the government's rampant corruption and unravel the web of mystery surrounding Max's origin. While some missions rely on stealth elements, the bulk of the gameplay in Dark Angel is hand-to-hand -hand combat. Mixing in over 50 different fighting moves, Max's agility comes in handy when taking on groups of futuristic tough guys. The rather simple controls lack the sort of depth that might keep the game interesting. Oftentimes, simply hitting random buttons will pull off some impressive punches, kicks, and flips. But since the AI doesn't offer much of a challenge, the results are somewhat underwhelming. For fans of the show, the first few levels are interesting since you get to engage in flashy combat with Max. But without a solid game to fall back on, there's very little substance beyond the initial thrill. So gamers void of a personal attachment to the license will probably want to skip it altogether. We give James Cameron's Dark Angel a lackluster 2 out of 5. You're done already? I was just getting started.